Greetings and good evening, dear ladies and gentlemen. This is, of course, your crypto enthusiast, Light Liger here. And today I'm very delighted to do a review on this blockchain based platform called Odyssey. Now, what exactly is Odyssey? So, this is a web based version of the library application, which I reviewed twice on the channel and talked about it in other videos as well. And, library is a decentralized peer to peer video platform which can also host images articles and even you know small types of flash games so basically this is their web-based solution for those who don't want to download the library application to their PC and in case you already hold an account on library you can use that to log in basically to Odyssey and Odyssey is pretty much one-to-one -one copy of uh, the library application. There are some differences between the interface. So this is a bit more uh, purple-like and the library interface is a bit more darker, I would say. And there's some other social media features, which we are going to be touching upon in this video, which are slightly different that you're going to be seeing on the library's application. Now, other thing you need to also understand that library has their own token, which is called LBC, their own blockchain, and it's a proof of work coin and basically you can get those LPC rewards by doing different stuff on the platform like watching videos and you can watch my videos and get paid in LBC. Also creators get more rewards when people watch their videos, when they hit uh, new subscriber milestones um, and other types of, you know, you know, incentives, which we can probably touch upon first because people love money, obviously on this channel, how to make more money. And in my opinion, library is one of the best, uh, platforms to basically earn, um, revenue right now by doing different stuff. So one of the things you can do is inviting friends to the platform. I will be having my own, uh, referral link down below for you to register to Odyssey in case you don't have an account yet. And basically you can get eight light LBC per one invite. Uh, you can also watch videos on the platform and this will be a scaled up uh, throughout the site. And then there's obviously followers, daily watch reward, which is from 0 0.2 to 100, that is random. And then there's also, you know, following different people on the platform. So more people you follow, more rewards you will get. Usually also with library, for instance, when you up update the newest version, you will be getting like 20 LBC, 15 LBC as a sign up reward. And here you can see a bit of a feed on platforms and, you know, the rewards I've been getting. So, you know, I get up around maybe 200, something like that. Uh, per month around and there has been it kind of depends on many many different uh, factors and there are a multitude of different uh, videos and creators on the platform a lot of blockchain based creators there are a lot of big creators as well on the platform and it has been growing up um, uh, you know pretty well for a crypto platform It's actually one of the largest crypto platforms and I would say that it's one of the more successful ones at the same time and let's say like Naomi Brockwell, who I've, you know, signed into already has a 50,000 people following her on library. So that is pretty impressive. But let's kind of like open one of her videos here. So as I said, everything is peer to peer. So everything will be downloading at uh, uh, a certain uh, speed here. And one of the things that is different between Odyssey and library is this like and dislike, you know, system. So these don't actually appear on the library client. Um, you could say that there are certain elements which we could argue that are not being, maybe they're tested out on Odyssey and then they will roll them out on library and vice versa. There can be things like these. One of the other things you can do in terms of the LPC utility is you can actually also boost certain content. So I can support this content and um, I can also send tips. People can send me tips if they want to, or they can boost my content. And the boosting basically, you know, increases the discoverability of the content while the boost is being active. So now I have 32 LBC and I can put that into my own videos or anybody's videos in case I want to highlight those videos on the platform. You don't lose that money. It is just basically kind of like staked and you can like unstake it basically and withdraw it and trade it basically. 
Now, there's also comment sections which have come out. Um, they're kind of like a more of a newer feature. I don't remember on my last library video, uh, did they have that right now, but now they do. Uh, YouTube has notoriously very bad comment section because it doesn't really inform me when comments are sometimes coming, especially on nested messages. And it's hard to kind of keep you know, track of things. And there's a lot of like blacklisting, shadow banning, lots of things like that, which are not good. Um, so library, I think is very easy to use, very clean. Uh, uploading is pretty nice. You can also directly port all of your YouTube videos um, to library by linking your account with the, the Google thing. And it basically will just automatically bring all the videos um, in into the platform. So my my, my uh, account name is Light Liger New. I had an old one. And I don't remember the reason why I, you know, changed the old one. Yeah, the thing was I was manually uploading. So every time my video comes into YouTube now it's automatically basically uploaded into library. So they might come on a 30 minute delay versus YouTube and you can watch them ad free. There's no ads on Odyssey. So uh, in case you don't watch like watching ads and you know, stuff like that on YouTube, you can watch me directly also on Odyssey slash library. And uh, basically all my videos are being founded here. Uh, I think pretty much everything and that's pretty nice. So um, you can access all that content in case uh, for some whatever reason, YouTube would close my channel down for whatever reason in the future. So uh, it's, it's pretty nice. Uh, and there's some like exclusive content which are no longer on the channel as well, like uh, AMAs and some some stuff which I don't keep on YouTube. But um, it's it's a pretty um, nice platform. There are obviously um, certain problems. Um, first of all, I don't, I have been very kind of vehemently against a lot of these bad old tech proof of work coins. I think it would be much better for Odyssey to just transform perhaps into a proof of stake coin, something that has a smart contract capability so they can uh, bring the LBC token into Ethereum and access DeFi and having a bit more opportunities with it, bringing more liquidity to the thing because right now you can only trade it at Bittrex basically. I think that is the only place right now where the LBC is basically accepted. Then there was obviously huge pre-mine, but these things are kind of like it doesn't really matter that much in the end of things, but it's just like looking from the perspective, like how this could become more valuable and more used in the future. And I see Odyssey as one of the more uh, important products that have been built in crypto. A lot of people tend to talk about price all the time, but ultimately the blockchain's worth is really revolving around the value of fighting against censorship. And that's where, where we can get access with Odyssey by having these videos on the IPFS, having articles on the IPFS. And these are some things you can find on other platforms and they can be removed and stuff like that. So that is something that I really appreciate. And alongside with platforms like, you know, Hive, I really consider these very valuable, but I think because of those poor tokenomics and especially because you don't have such a high hashing power for it, 51% attacks are definitely on the table. So there could be people doing damage on the network. And I think library really started as a project, which wasn't uh, at the first go, it wasn't a cryptocurrency project. They just adapted crypto later on. And it makes a lot of sense, but right now they really need to think about um, how do we exactly take the token to the next level? Because the utility is kind of there. I understand you have the staking, the supporting thing, but aside from that, I don't really have staking opportunities. I don't have DeFi opportunities. I don't have liquidity opportunities. So they have to build a bridge system. Either, either to create a, uh, you know, an Ethereum on Matic or an other Cardano, whatever side chain. Uh, I think it would like a lot more grants and supports from those chains as well, instead of being an independent, um, you know, uh, blockchain. I don't, there are benefits to that in terms of fighting against censorship. And then there's obviously 
uh, aspects which are not so good from a tokenomics perspective. But then again, a lot of the data is on the IPFS side of things. So I don't think even if the blockchain is attacked, I think there might be still a lot of uh, security for the network. And I don't know what this button does. This is some type of a comment section. But um, overall, um, that is kind of like rundown of, you know, Odyssey. I find it a pretty good uh, platform, a lot of different good content video and the, the front page has a lot of, you know, quality content in my opinion. And a lot of big members have come into library and you can find all types of stuff and a lot of your uh, favorite big creators even. And uh, comment sections are good. There's a lot of options, obviously, for quality as well, the speed of the video. Um, I don't think they do have a Chromecast though, but um, that might be something they wanna, you know, think about in the future or something similar. But um, uh, that is pretty much my rundown. In case you wanna support me, you can sign up uh, for the actual video uh, for the platform in my, you know, referral link. And also you can follow me on actual library. That also helps me out a lot. Thanks for watching. I will be seeing you guys on the next video. Cheers.